can I become a hero with gene manipulation? In many movies these days, we see ordinary people getting special abilities with gene manipulation. Are heroes with abilities to shoot fire and ice crystals possible in reality? There's already a lot of genetic modification going on in the real world. A variety of useful foods that have never been before are being developed, such as corn resistant to pests, yellow rice containing vitamin A, and salmon that have grown 36 times larger through genetic recombination. To date, several studies have proven them to be safe. So is the genetic manipulation of humans possible? Until the 2000s, there was no technology to read human DNA. But in 2003, the first mapping of the human genome was completed. But there were still a lot of things that we didn't know. Just the analysis was completed. There is a lot of DNAs, and we don't know which part of it does what, and we don't know how much influence it has. In other words, let's say there are DNAs called A, B, and C, all of which affect muscle strength. However, it is difficult to analyze since DNAs affect each person differently, such as 60% of A, 30% of B, and 10% of C. However, as the technology for gene analysis is rapidly growing and the cost of the analysis is going down, many people have been able to do gene analysis. Due to this, a lot of data has been collected and the genetic scissors technology was introduced based on this. With the gene scissors, the genes that can cause fatal diseases such as cancer and AIDS are cut in advance, crashing the risk factors. If this happens, you might wonder, isn't it possible for everyone to be disease-free and have superpowers? However, gene manipulation was strictly reviewed and banned through the International Summit for various reasons. This is because widespread environmental changes are difficult to reverse. Once mutated genes are difficult to remove, and there is a risk of spreading. There was a huge incident in China. A couple with AIDS deleted an AIDS-related gene by manipulating the genes of an embryo before the baby was born, in fear of passing it on to their child. You might think that erasing a fatal disease would be a good thing, but if you indiscriminately manipulate the embryonic gene, you don't know what will happen, and we know nothing about the safety. Just as it's dangerous, you don't have skin safe from burning even if you get the ability to breathe fire with your hands through genetic manipulation. The conclusion is that it is true that you can get a strong body with genetic scissors and have superpowers if the technology develops in the future. However, due to ethical concerns and safety, it is currently prohibited. Today, we looked at Can I Become a Hero with Gene Manipulation 